fans were gutted when you did not host the Oscars. Yeah. Do you think there's any chance we'll see you do it one day? No, absolutely not. <laughs> Let's, uh, let's just throw that hope right out the window right now. You just, whatever level of hope you have, I want to destroy it. Right now, no. Not at all. Uh, those gigs aren't good gigs for comics. And it's no shot to the Oscars, no shot to the Globes or anything else. Those just aren't, um, you know, comedy-friendly environments anymore. So uh, I think they got it right one year where it was like just a bunch of personalities acted as the host. And mm. that's a nice thing. It's a collaborative thing. Different people get to be responsible for Act 1, Act 2, Act 3. But, you know, the days of it being a room for a comic... Those days are done. Um, Shouts out to those that have cracked the code and done it right early on. You know, uh, the Chris Rocks of the world, uh, the Billy Crystals of the world, the Globes have had like Tina Fey, Amy Poehler, mm. um, Ricky Gervais. I mean, you know, there's a lot of people that so many of your fans understand it. But if you're not an industry comic, meaning uh, a comic that has the relationships of all, then those rooms are very cold. So me doing it is. Of course, I had an advantage because I know the room and I'm familiar with so many. But uh, for others, it's not the same. Mm, awesome. Look at well, that broken down. Do you know what? I'm, I'm personally gutted. Yes, it's going to make the Oscars a lot less fun for me. But you get it me, now. But... It's like, oh, he actually makes sense. It's mm. like, it's not the gig that it was of old. It's too many. And I'm not even going to lie. Kevin Hart, he's kind of right. Look what they did to fucking Chris Rock. Will Smith had no business going up. They slapping the shit out of Chris. He had no business. All because of a G.I. Jane joke. You know what I'm saying? You can't get mad because your bitch look like The Rock. You know what I'm saying? She got a head like The Rock. It was a joke. If anybody know what G.I. Joe is, he called her G.I. Jane, which means it's like a remix of G.I. Joe. You know what I'm saying? She did look like The Rock with that bald ass damn head. So, man, you know what I'm saying? I think Kevin is right in this situation. You know, I 